Hi guys, we are going to solve the question of pipe and tank with the ratio method. So let's read the question. A tank has a lake which would empty the completely filled tank in 10 hours if the tank is full and a tape which admit 4 liter of water per minute in the tank and a leak take 15 hours to empty the tank. What is the capacity of the tank? So in this question, we need to find the capacity of the tank. So let's understand the equation. <coughs> we got uh, one pipe which is leaking and an, another pipe which is filling the tank uh, with the capacity with the, uh, with the rate of 4 liter of water per minute. So let's suppose we got A pipe, pipe A, it is leaking. leak and uh, you can say let's suppose it is taking 10 hours okay and we got uh, here another pipe uh, pipe B but it is working with pipe A uh, pipe A and pipe A is leak you know that and uh, let's suppose pipe B is filling water filling and uh, we know that it is taking you can say 15 hours okay 15 hours and uh, this this pipe is taking 10 hours right so if you take calcium of both it will become you can say uh, 15 and it will become 30 units right and uh, and if we go with the ratio method if we divide 10 upon need 30 upon 10 then it will become 3 unit and this will become 2 unit right <coughs> now you can see that if we take this as uh, you can say per minute per hour you can say this per hour unit okay now according to the question <coughs> Uh, pipe when the when the tank is completely filled a pipe it will take 10 hours <coughs> to empty it completely okay so here if we divide this let's suppose it will if they are both working and it will take 3 plus 2 unit then it will become 5 unit 5 ut sorry uh, you can say this pipe A is taking minus 10 unit you can say uh, it will take minus 3 unit why because this pipe <coughs> is emptying the our bucket constraint tank you can you can say whatever and this is adding to it and if we subtract uh, equation 1 from equation 2 we got uh, <coughs> 3ut 3ut you can say 3ut and plus 2ut right now we got you can say minus 1 unit 1 unit so uh, and we and uh, from this equation we can see that b pipe pipe b which is filling uh, you can say filling the tank filling the tank and this will and uh, this is taking one unit so the the, the capacity of the tank is six, uh, you can say 30 unit and uh, we, we got one unit from from pipe b so for complete for you can say you can say if pipe b is working alone then this will take uh, 30 unit divide by 1 unit and you can say it will take uh, 30 divided by 1 this will become 30 hours right and uh, we know that in 1 minute yeah for 
we can say pop uh, pop pipe b in one minute it can fill four liter right four liter and uh, if we need to calculate for one hour in one hour we know that there are 60 minutes right one hour uh, four into 60 it will become 240 liter liter sorry liter 240 liter in one hour so we got 30 hours right so 240 liter in one hour multiply by 30 hours right and uh, this will become how much 24 multiplied by 3 is 72 72 and we got 20 20 liter so we will go with the option 2 and the correct answer of this question is 7200 liters is uh, this is the capacity of the tank so guys uh, here is our new question in this question we got that two pipes can fill a tank with the water in in 15 hours and 12 hours respectively and a third pipe which can empty it in four hours right uh, there are two pipes which are filling and uh, there is another pipe which is emptying the tank if the pipes to be op opened in the order of 8 9 and 11 am respectively the tank will be emptied at how much how much time it will take to empty the tank right so if you see that we got uh, pipe a uh, we got here pipe a and uh, this pipe is uh, having the capacity of 15 hours right and uh, here we got pipe B which is having a capacity and not capacity we can say filling capacity of 12 hours right and here we got you can say pipe C uh, you can say leaking or emptying you can say empty pipe which will take uh, I'm going to write only pipe C which will take four hours right you can say four hours four hours but this will go in negative right because the third pipe is emptying our tank tank not filling it right so if we take lcm of both uh, both uh, you can say not both if we take lcm of these three pipes it will become how much uh, 60 unit right if we take lcm of this and if we divide if we take 15 and 60 if we take 15 and 60 this will become how much uh, you can say how much it will become 4 unit no uh, 5 unit right 5 unit of water you can say this is per hour per hour uh, for uh, 5 unit of water and this will how much take Uh, this will take 15 sorry uh, this guy is <laughs> not going to take this guy is not going to take 5 unit of water this guy is going to take only 4 unit of water <coughs> uh, so here we are going to write 4 unit of water and for for pipe B it will take how much 5 unit of water and uh, for pipe C for pipe C you can say this will take how much uh, 60 divided by 4 how much it will become it will become 12 12 unit 12 unit of water this is negative right negative so according to the question according to the question at uh, 8 a.m. only pipe one is open at 8 am only pipe a is working from 8 p from 8 am to 9 am only pipe a is working right so here it will become how much of water you can say water uh, it will 
for one hour it this will add four unit of water in the tank okay and uh, from if we take 9 from 9 a.m. to 11 a.m. <coughs> pipe a plus pipe b are working together okay so a plus b a is taking four unit of water and uh, filling four unit of water and b is filling five unit of water so it they are working for two hours right two two multiply by uh, for a this is four unit of water and for b this is of five unit of water and this will become how much this will become 9 and into 2 how much it will become 18 yeah and uh, we can see that after 11 am the C pipe is also opened which is which is emptying our tank okay after 11 am all pipe are working right so you can say that 4 plus 5 minus 12 this will become how much this will become 12 uh, look wait 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 I think I made some mistake yeah here it will become <coughs> Uh, this thing is going to become 15 sorry guys uh, sorry for miscalculation this guy is going to become 15 unit of water so here we are going to write again four plus five minus 15 minus 15 so this will become how much uh, six unit six unit negative remember that negative so <coughs> till 11 am you can say that 4 plus 18 how much it will become 4 plus 18 this will become uh, which is equal to 22 unit of water and after 11 am you can say there is a decrement in the water with 6 unit per hour so if we divide by we got 22 unit of water in our tank is divided by 6 unit of water per hour this will become how much this will become 6 3 3 and uh, 3 hour and uh, 4 by 6 4 by 6 right I'm going to increase it this will become 4 into 6 so we got uh, 3 hour and 4 by 6 and which is equivalent to 3 hour 3 hour plus uh, if we take 4 divided by 6 multiply by 60 uh, you know that in 1 hour we got 60 minute and this will become how much uh, 40 40 minutes so <coughs> this is our answer and you can say that at 11 am we from 11 am we need to calculate the time if we add 11 am 11 am plus 3 hour and 40 minutes this will become how much guys this will become 11 plus 3 2 2 dot you can say 40 pm this is our correct answer and we will go with option 4 right <coughs>